Bismillahirrahmanirrahim in the name of Allah the most merciful the most kind connect to Allah because this line is never busy always answered no hang up no heartbreak how Allah took responsibility for who reads the Quran and acts on what is in it he won't go astray in this life nor despair in hereafter today's learning objective are clinical presentation gross morphology microscopic features of primary ovarian cancer as you know the malignant tumors of the ovary are silent killers because why they are silent killers 75% diagnosed with advanced stage disease and 5 year survival only 10 to 28% they are rare before 40 years of age the symptoms are vague like bloating menstrual disorders pelvic pain feeling full quickly when eating frequent urination change in bowel habit ascites that is collection of fluid in the abdomen unexplained weight loss now origin of ovarian tumors they are uh, surface epithelial tumor germ cell tumor sex cord stromal tumors 5 to 8 percent are arise from sex cord uh, stroma 15 to 20 percent from germ cell and majority are surface epithelial tumors and among surface epithelial tumors majority are serous malignant tumors then mucinous and endometriite like endometrial uh, glands now clinical presentation is a 47 year old women presented with pressure sensation in pelvic region for the past five months on physical examination there was a right adenexal mass an ultrasound scan shows 10 cm fluid filled cystic mass in the right ovary along with ascitic fluid this is the ovarian tumor uh, excised uh, on gross inspection you can see a cystic and partly solid ovarian tumor fallopian tube is stretched across this is large in size and when cut open it shows cystic and partly solid areas and filled with straw colored thin fluid now we take section from this tumor and observe under microscopic now the microscopic uh, examination reveal fibrous wall of the tumor and complex papillae and uh, deeper uh, there is uh, invasion of stroma the malignant glands are present in the wall of the tumor and there are somoma bodies as you can see concentric uh, round calcific structures stroma somoma bodies are actually calcific collections uh, it is a form of dystrophic calcification uh, calcium salts uh, su surrounding necrotic cells now there is higher magnification show pleomorphism variation in size and shape of the nuclei abnormal chromatin coarse chromatin and there are uh, hyperchromasia there is darkly stained nuclei uh, increase high this is called hyperchromasia and then high nc ratio the large uh, amount of cells is occupied by the nucleus so we can summarize the microscopic features uh, compact pupillary architecture malignant cells in glandular pattern uh, nuclear atypia high moiety activity stratification and stromal invasion if we summarize the uh, information that adenexal mass in old age cytic fluid cystic partly solid grossly complex pupillary architecture, stromal invasion, nuclear atypia, abnormal chromatin pattern and pleomorphism on microscopic examination. 
so we can name the lien as serous cyst adenocarcinoma ovary uh, because the epithelium is serous it is cystic and it is malignant so uh, next video will be on mucinous cyst adenocarcinoma ovary thank you for watching my video i hope you learned uh, gross and microscopic features subscribe this channel like and share this video